Hey guys, this is Unkar here and welcome back to another video and in this video we are going to talk about the Dirty Unicorn ROM, the official DU ROM for the <coughs> Moto X Play. So, quickly jumping into the settings and about phone, we can see that this ROM is running on top of Android 7.1.2 and has the security patch of May 5, 2017 and this ROM doesn't follow the pixel color scheme that is white and blue, instead it follows the white and green which gives us the feel that we are still using Marshmallow which I really don't like and this ROM has really minimal bugs and like really no bugs uh, but I, I wasn't able to test the World TE because I don't have any Reliance Geo SIM with me right now and so talking about the features about this ROM it does support all the Motorola tweaks like if you, if you pick up your phone you'll get to see the glance at the notifications if notifications are there and you also get the double twist to open the camera feature and capture the images the camera app on this phone is really nice and does give you some really nice looking photos as well and let's quickly jump into the customization section of this ROM uh, and we have the system wide customizations like the motor actions expanded and stuff and miscal image and power menu customization and the motor actions you can see that pick up to see the notifications wave your hand to have a glance at your notification double twist to open the camera and chop chop to enable the flashlight and flip to enter the phone into the do not disturb mode and pick up to stop ringing the phone so these are this some of these are not actually available on the motor display but they are included in this ROM and they do work going ahead into the lock screen you can customize the lock screen items status bar you can like see that i have enabled the network indicator on the status bar similarly you can change the battery icon as well as the add some carrier level etc settings are available here you can customize the navigation bar but i do prefer to have the stop navigation bar and in multitasking you can have omni switch as your recents instead of the normal eosp style recents and that's it from the customization section while talking more about this rom that uh, this is an official rom but as the dirty unicorn announced that the uh, Dirty Unicorn version 11.7 will be the last version 11.4 uh, will be the last version sorry 11.7 will be the last version so we can expect that this phone receives 11.7 version of the Dirty Unicorn ROM but as you can see that Android Oreo is already out so you might not get to see much of love for this device on the Dirty Unicorn ROM but uh, the stability of the ROM is really nice and battery backup is medium I get around Three and a half to four hours of screen on time and then nothing more to talk about this guys that's it from this video if you like this video please do give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more such awesome content